hello guys welcome to my channel my name is karen and the name of my channel is pr girl for puerto rican girl in today's video i'm very excited because i'm gonna be sharing with you my first ever throat beats haul now before i show you everything i wanted to mention that i'm gonna reserve fridays for my pandora related content friday is my typical uploading day and then on occasional Mondays, maybe every other Monday, I'm gonna do other types of videos related to other things and other brands of jewelry. And hence the case of today is Trollbits. Now, I didn't know about Trollbits, to be honest with you. I learned about Trollbits and other brands of jewelry that sells um, charms or, or beads, um, thanks to being on this wonderful community. Um, it was actually Sharon from Brucey Bows on Instagram, and hi Sharon if you're watching, as well as Steph from the For, uh, For the Love of Jewelry, the ones that told me that there was a Trollby store here in Puerto Rico. Um, I learned about this last year, and when I went to the store, they told me that the store opened in 2014, so five years after it was when I learned of it. Ironically, yes, yes. Um, but just very excited that I just went to visit. When I went to the store, they were running a promotion that if you bought um, three beads, then you will get one free. They also have 25% on their gold jewelry, which wasn't happening, you know, I wish. Um, the other one was if you bought one class for the foxtail bracelet, which is the typical um, bead bracelet for them then you will get the foxtail bracelet for free. And the other one was if you bought an open bangle, then you will get a free pair of basic spacers. When I went to the store, they also had a trunk show. And the trunk show, what I learned from the ladies, which were really nice to me, is a special event where they been a special glass beads. And I knew for many years, that Trollbeats was the one that did the Muranos for Pandora. I don't know if they still do. If you know, please let me know in the comment section down below. But I knew for many years that Trollbeats did the Murano for Pandora because you know, their glass beads, Trollbeats glass beads are amazing. So in the trunk show, and I'm gonna include some footage and pictures here of my visits to the store, they have um, some jumbo beads. They also bring um, regular beads they have in the store, particularly rear stone. For example, in the store, they might have some ruby um, glass beads, but the one that they bring to the trunk show might be more vibrant, for example. They also have um, all the universal core glass beads. And to be honest with you, I didn't purchase anything from the trunk show because I just wanted to explore the regular brand. And that's what I did for this um, first purchase. Now, they also gave me a booklet, and um, this is related to the um, spring collection, the new spring collection. It's called Love Stories, and I thought that I would explore it with you a little bit. So, it says every story has a bead because that's their slogan, and look at this. My goodness, those glass beads are just amazing. That's the foxtail bracelet that I was talking about, for those of you who don't know. And then, this is the um, clasp that they brought for this spring collection, the Lady Box Clasp. Look at that glass bead. I love it, love it, love it. And they also have this very interesting ring where you can just put any glass bead that you wish. And I love that because according to your outfit, you can exchange it. They also have this frog ring, which I know that Idona from my Pandora Moments, she also have a an Instagram page which is my Troll Beats moment, which is dedicated only to Troll Beats. So hi, Lona, if you're watching. She also introduced me to the brand. And then over here, we have these open bangles. The day I went to the store, I was um, wearing my Mores open bangle, the one with Rose. And I have a picture here that I put it um, close next to the copper bangle from Mores because I know some, I mean, copper bangle from Troll Beats because I know some of you have asked me about the Mores um, open bangles and how they really do troll beads and to be honest with you um, I didn't find much difference and I'm glad to know that the um, troll beads pieces fit on mores but look at that gorgeous glass bead with the roses beautiful beautiful I just wish that um, troll beads would have more universal gold beads so they could fit on Pandora but maybe just you know just be wanting too much perhaps i don't know okay so then here we have the love stories collection which is the love rings in gold and silver 
Then we have the Song of Love, Beautiful Glass Bead, as well as Kindness. Then we have Flow Bead, the Ale of Passion Glass Bead, which I'm in love with those colors. The peach slash orange, the lavender, the flowers with the glitter, just beautiful. Then we have the Home Bead. And then here is a pendant that you put on those fantasy necklaces, which I honestly need to learn about. I know Ilona got this pendant, and this is the fantasy necklace with the pearl. Love it, love it, love it. They still use real stones. Then we have the serpentine glass bead, gorgeous green. Over there, the feldspar, quartz rock, romance, beautiful lady box bead. Love the details. Boys of happiness, boys of romance. And then let me flip the other side because for those of you who are um, fans of Moon and Stars, this is for you. It says my song, Moon and Stars. They have the round stone stone, the letter spacers, gorgeous Moon and Stars pendant. Love it, love it, love it. Limited edition Happy New Year B, beautiful. The go round with the round lapis lazuli as well as the frame by C bead over here. On the other side, we have the limited edition Sense of Shimmer, People Bead of 2019, which is the third flower. Love it on my wish list. So, yes, now I have a troll bees wish list. <laughs> okay, Golden Nightfall with the round amethyst, flower red, and then these gorgeous flowers of poise. Beautiful colors. Look at those colors. Oh my goodness. Leaf of Grace over here, framed by nature, and then the round red onyx. So beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. Okay, so that was me a little bit telling you my experience and a little bit about the new collection. So let's go now to see my mini haul. Okay, so what I got is in this box. I really love how elegant it looks. So it's coming up in camera gray, but it's actually black. And it says Troll Beats, the original since 1976 over here. And for those of you who are fans of the brand, then you might know what is in here. So the way you open it, it just pin this up. And yes, you see the pick in here. So I got the famous Fox tape bracelet. So I took advantage of that promo where you bought the class, then you will get this bracelet for free. I love the oxidization detail on it, it's beautiful. And then here you see that it has the X925 for the silver, as well as the LAA initials. And maybe that's related to the people that found it. If you know, please let me know what those initials stand for in the comments down below. But let me close it so I could show you the, I mean, I still mention, I'm still saying class, but the actual way is lock it. So let me just show you my lock. So I got the lock from the spring 2020 collection, which is the Lady Box Clock. I really fall in love with the attention to details on this lock. And I decided to go for this one. I was looking at another one, which was the Jemima's flower, I think it was. But since I want to do my first bracelet, a nature theme bracelet, I thought that this was more appropriate for that. But you know, both of them were just gorgeous. And um, so in here you see the S925, and I believe on the other side is where you have the letters, the LA letters. It's not focusing there. L A L L A A the LAA letters and I love the attention to details of this so what I learned from the store is that the foster bracelet has two sides the smaller one is where you introduce your beads and the bigger one is the one that you um, close and open when you want to wear your bracelet and what about about, about what I love about this lock is that to open it you just put it in here and as, as you see that end part in there is also another ladybug. Look at how beautiful. And then the other side where you open and close to put your bracelet is actually this ladybug over here that you press in order to open it. Look at how beautiful. Love it, love it, love it, love it. 
And now I will show you the beads that I decided to get. So the first one, and let me look at my receipt so I can tell you the appropriate name. It's called Florence Bead. And it's this glass bead. I was going for, as I said, a nature theme, but I was thinking more about like a pond. And I love this color for that. I also love that the bead is with some texture. So it's like 3D. And I love the colors of it because it's like a light shade of green with some hints of yellow and brown. It's just gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous. And the other one that I got is a silver bead. And look at how cute. This is called the Ugly Duckling Bead, and I just found it so pretty and so, so cute. So it has the Ugly Duckling, as you can see there, and then there's this leaf that reminds me of a pond, like maybe water lily, it's just gorgeous. And then on the other side, over here, it has like, for me, it's maybe a frog, um, and then some mushrooms, it's just, so beautiful the attention to details to of these tweets are just amazing 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 and one thing that i really like was that this glass bead as you can see the ugly dunkling bean stands up by its own it's just so beautiful um i know that um troll bees doesn't fit on pandora but pandora does fit on troll bit so because i had this murano that i wasn't using it on any of my bracelet i decided that because i'm going for the nature team that for now i'm gonna include this murano on my uh, bracelet so let me see if i got the smaller side so i can introduce the murano uh, where is this side so i just open it here and then let me put the Murano. So let me close it for you. Here you go. Yeah, that's it. So look, I just really, 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 really love it. I think it looks beautiful. <laughs> love it. Okay, so then with my purchase, they gave me two things. One was this um, troll bit um, polishing cloth. So I haven't opened it, so let me open it with you. I thought that was really nice of them. Oh, that's really nice. So it's a polishing cloth. Unfold it. So it said troll bits, the original since 1976. And they also gave me this. I know this is something that you use to place the beads on from your fantasy necklace so you could track them but she also told me that if you have beads that you want to clean your bracelet and you have them you want to have them in the same order you just put them in here while you clean it so that's something nice and then I learned that there is also a loyalty program so she gave me this um, loyalty card and I know that the loyalty program is only in stores, but I'm gonna show you anyway. It says, receive a stamp for every Trollbits in-store bit purchase. Receive one free unique Trollbits glass bit with a total of 12 stamps. Offer redeemable only at Trollbit retail stores. So because I bought the Florence bit as well as the Ugly Donkey, I got these two stamps. And they have stores in Freehold, New Jersey, New York, New York, assuming that's New York City, West Hartford, Connecticut, Novi, Michigan, Tampa, Florida, Stromville, Ohio, and then Canovanas, Puerto Rico. So yeah, guys, I think with this, I'm finishing this video. I really hope that you enjoy watching. And if you did, please remember to give it a thumbs up and consider subscribing to my channel. I will see you on Friday. Thank you very much for watching. Bye-bye. Gracias.